It's the NFL on EA Sports, where we'll see two of the NFL's oldest and most storied franchises. It's the New York Giants and the Pittsburgh Steelers, next on Madden Football. The first contest played here is still the highest attended game in NFL history. And crowds pushing 80,000 continue to arrive every time the league plays at Estadio Azteca here in Mexico City. Thanks for joining us, everyone. With my partner, Brock Heward, I'm Kate Scott. And like Teed up Chris Boswell to do the honors. And we're off and running from Estadio Azteca. Return coming from the six. And he brought this one almost to midfield before he's tackled. Special teams always play an important role in ball games, and it does right here from the jump. That's going to give the offense terrific field position for this opening drive. Play action on first down. He's got it inside the 25. It's a 33-yard gain and a fresh center downs. Now they'll hit the line just outside the red zone following that big play. On first down, they'll run. And they corral him after a minimal gain to the 21. Second down now, seven to go. From the 21. And he will score a touchdown, New York. The Giants take a 6-0 lead right away. So a picture-perfect way to begin this ball game, Bronk. Their opening drive ends in six. Yeah, no question about it. That's how you do it. You work all week to script out the opening drive, and it's huge when it pays off like that. That one splits the uprights. And they add one on to their first touchdown of the contest. Gano ready to send this away. That's going to be taken in at the 8. And he's brought down just inside the 25 on the return. They'll get this drive started. First and 10. Wilson looking to throw. And the Giants are too much. They take him down. And the big play drives them backwards. Second down coming up. Trying again, following the sack. He'll get this to Jefferson. And it's a nice game, but still not enough for the first. Here they come. This is third and five. Throwing now from the gun. Down he goes. The Giants got to him. And the defense comes through to back him up ahead of fourth down. On fourth down, the Steelers are going to turn to Cameron Johnston to punt this away. He'll start from the 39. And they bring him down to put a stop to that return. And after the punch, the offense comes out onto the field. And the Giants are going to like where they start out for this drive. They go play action on first. He'll dump this one off to his running back complete. And he's able to reach the 40 on that play. I call this quarterback's best friend. Some call it a safety valve, some call it automatic, but it's sure nice as a quarterback when you've got a trusty running back over the middle of the field that you can depend on. Here's second and two. And that's nearly intercepted, but couldn't hang on. Just a harmless incompletion. It's third down. They'll try and pick this up on the ground. And his short game gets them a new set of downs. So that connection for a first will bring us to the end of the...
Welcome back. We'll begin this second quarter with the Giants in possession. They've got first and ten here, looking to add to their lead. Jones now to throw. Connects with Slayton. And he's down inside the red zone before hitting the deck. That play good for 17 and a first down. And with a half of football left to play, we can see already how close he is to that 100-yard mark in this game. Gotta think that he stands a good chance of reaching it with plenty of time left to go. First down from the red zone. And he will score. It's a New York touchdown. The Giants take a 13-point lead. Well, they definitely wanted to get that one out quick, Brock. They did just that, and it ends in six. We hear it all the time, but it is so true, Kate. This is a game about matchups. And when you see a throw that quick, it really was determined pre-snap. It was great design and tremendous execution. You know, ready to send this away. And he opts not to bring this one out, so they're going to enjoy some good starting field position from the 30. They're out and set, first and 10. Well, we've already seen some nice plays here, and we're going to see plenty more before this game ends, but you might be thinking, caught him deep behind the line. Oh, the ball is out! And it's picked out by the Giants. And this will be a scoop and score. He brings it back for the touchdown. I think they would have happily just taken the turnover, Brock. But how about the wherewithal of the defender to take it back for the score? Yeah, that is a scoop and score in the definition of a splash play defensively. You don't just rip possession away from the offense. Kind of rip their heart out, too. You rip possession, you turn it into points, and now that beleaguered offense is going to have to get right back on the field. Still reeling a little after fumbling that away, but they're going to get it right back with this kickoff. And he opts not to bring this one out, so they're going to enjoy some good starting field position from the 30. Drive starts out with a first and 10. Pittsburgh getting its offense all set to go. Now here's Ross. And there's a man there. It's intercepted. Jason Pinnock picks it. Oh, man, I'm having to hold my partner back after this one. Captain Fundamental not happy that he didn't take the time to stop and get set before delivering that football. Got to think that that, in part, led to the turnover. Yeah, Captain Fundamental because I couldn't run. Kind of like Tom Brady, right? But he's the essence of it. He's the... And he will score a touchdown, New York! The Giants capitalize on the turnover and add to their lead. That is his third touchdown catch. Certainly enough to call this a very good game for him. And we're still in the opening half, so what else might he accomplish before we're done here? That one right down the middle. And they'll continue adding to their lead. Gino ready to send this away. Return starts from the goal line. And he's brought down. The offense will come onto the field. And the drive will start out with a first and ten. Now the offense getting set to go for the Steelers. They are coming off their first interception of the game. This drive now a chance to rebuild some confidence. And they're able to grind him to a halt after a pickup of four. Second and six coming up here. Wilson to throw it. Warren's got it complete. And he crosses the sideline a yard or two beyond, it looks like, the 30. Battle coming up on third and inches. Here's a give up the middle. And he'll get taken down after advancing this to the 37. We're to the two-minute warning from Mexico. The Steelers looking for a score before halftime. Markers reset, ball at the 37. Here's Wilson to the air. Oh, no, he lost control of another one. And it's picked out by the Giants. 
think the defense would have just settled for getting off the field with the takeaway, but they had a nice present on to the end for their teammates who start this possession with a much better field position. Throwing now, following the turnover. This one's caught. And they'll get this down nearly to the end zone. Instead, stopped at the two. A nice pickup of 11 there, Brock, and they'll have first and goal to figure out. They'll try and punch it in. And he will take it in. Touchdown, New York. The Giants boat racing them to the halftime locker room. Devin Singletary with the touchdown. That one splits the uprights. And they'll continue adding to their lead. Send this away. He'll begin his return from the 11. And this drive will start inside the 25. The Steelers' offense headed out. They watch their fumble turn into points, so feeling maybe a little bit of an urge to make up for that now in this series. Rolling left, buying some time. And they finally bring him down, but that is a big gain and a new set of downs. One play in, and already they're close to midfield. Wilson now. Taken in by Harris. And they've got him behind the line for a big loss. Here's second and 14. And the Giants are too much. They take him down. Pittsburgh will go ahead and use its second timeout. And the Giants going nickel, third down coming. Out of the gun, they'll give it to him inside. And it's a nice game, but still not enough for the first. The Steelers set to punt it. And this will be his second effort of the contest. Ooh, it's away, but he knows he mishit that one. Headed for the sideline. This punt out of bounds. Up They've got first down here, but just 18 seconds to work with. Jones looking to throw. And that's going to be incomplete. Still time for a couple of plays, though. 15 seconds left. No dice on that prior pass. Here's second down. Here's Jones to throw. Deep down the right sideline. It's his running back making the catch. And he will score. It's a New York touchdown. The Giants get more points to end a lopsided first half. Devin Singletary with the touchdown. That one right down the middle. And they'll continue adding to their lead. Time left for maybe a return plus a play here as they send this away. And this will give them decent field position. The return gets out to the 30. Here comes the final play of our first half. Looking to throw. He's going to loft one deep to the left. Nothing near left side as it ends up incomplete. So we're in well, I guess we could have just kept both teams out here. We're moving past halftime and getting right to the start of the second half. Well, Brock, it has been a fun one so far, and hopefully it gets even better. Second half underway from Mexico City. And the return sets them up just beyond their own 20. Offense ready to begin this drive, first and 10. The Steelers, down Russell Wilson, headed back to the field now. And there's a couple of moments we're seeing here that I think he's not going to want to be reminded of after this game. Turnovers have just interrupted his performance in this one. Made it really tough for him and this team to get into and stay in any kind of rhythm. 
Here we go, second and nine. Escapes the pocket. Now he takes it. And he'll get taken down after advancing this to the 37. A new set of downs awaits him. Here's first and 10. And the Steelers first down. Out of the shotgun, they'll give it to him inside. And he made a bid for midfield there, but stopped on his own side at the 49. First and 10 from a yard shy of midfield. Here's Wilson. Short pass caught by his tight end. And he'll cross the 50 and start pushing onto the opposing side of the field. Second and six coming up here. It's now second and six at the 47 yard line. From the 47. Wow, it's free again. And this is going to stay with the offense as he makes the recovery. Well, I think you know the only thing redeeming about that play, Kate. They got the ball back. Yeah, well done. Yeah, they got the ball back, but a whole <laughs> lot longer down a distance. Third and long for him here. Couldn't connect across the middle. It's an incomplete pass. They'll send out the punting unit. It'll be Cameron Johnston doing the honors. And he sends this away. Definitely his best kick of the game thus far. And this one did hit at the eight, but took a big bounce and finished its journey in the end zone for a touchback. They'll get this drive started. First and ten. Throwing from the gun. Connection on the slant. And he's going to bring it up to the 40-yard line before he stopped. They get 20 yards out of the play and move the chains. Only took him one play, partner, and they've already made it to that 40-yard line. Option design here. Give him 15 yards on the pickup there. And it's good enough for a New York first down. And the Giants first down. First and 10. Throwing here, Jones. He's on the move. Throwing on the run, deep down that left side. And the Steelers get it back after a marvelous defensive effort. This, our last play of the quarter. The Steelers take over first and 10. They'll run here on first down. And they will stop him at the line on what proves to be the final play of this third quarter. Thankfully, only one quarter to play now. Second and 10, need to get some positive yardage here. Throwing is Wilson. Brian Muth there to bring it in. And that's good yardage there with a new set of downs to boot. All right, set now, first and 10. To throw, here's Wilson. Escapes the pocket. Oh, he was on the move, but so was the defense, and they take him down. All right, here we go, second down. Trying again, following the sack. This one is tipped away and incomplete. Good positioning to make a play on it. That forces third down. Brings up third down and 17. Wilson. Tried to connect, but it winds up incomplete. So out now comes the punter. And he's hoping for a well-placed strike. He's got this one at the 37. And they bring him down to put a stop to that return. Football on that 47-yard line, first down. Now an inside give to Singletary. And he gets it past the 50 and down to the Steelers' side of the field. Eight yards to go. Let's see how they approach this second down. So we're down to the two-minute warning here from New York. 
Giants rolling here in Laffer. Eight yards to go. Well, let's see how they approach this second down. Here's Singletary again. The ball's out. The ball's out. He lost it. Ooh, heads up play from the Giants there. They get to the loose ball and make the recovery. They're set up at the 35 now. Here's a handoff up the gut. And he drives into a pile of defenders and is stopped right at the line. Second and ten. Need to get some positive yardage here. Now stick with Singletary. And he'll be stopped after getting this down to the 31. They get about four there. Need a little more than that now on third and six. Brings up third and six. Back to the well again. And he'll get it down to the 24-yard line. A 70-yard pickup, and it moves the chains. They'll come up first and 10. They give it to him again. And he maneuvers through the middle for a gain of four. He'll expect more from himself on those type of plays, but there is nobody that's going to complain about that one. If you can do math, four plus four plus four equals a first down. Back-to-back -back carries here. And he works this to the 15 before they make the stop. Give him five yards to bring up a manageable third and one. That's a game of five. Brings up third and one. Takes the handoff. Now to throw. And we shouldn't be surprised as they connect in the end zone for yet another touchdown. The Giants throw some more onto this blowout. Gano for the PAT. That one splits the uprights, and they'll continue adding to their lead. You know, ready to send this away. And he opts not to bring this one out, so they're going to enjoy some good starting field. They're out and set, first and ten. Wilson looking to throw. Down he goes, the Giants got to him. And the big play drives them backwards, second down coming up. Another try following the sack. And the back-to-back -back sacks. Nice work by the defense there. Sets them up with a third down. The defense calls a timeout. So that's their first. Looking at a tough spot to punt it away if this third down is unsuccessful. From his own end zone on third and long. And they get to him again. And the defense comes through. That's going to back him up and bring up fourth down. So the Giants come away with the win. And if they could play at this level every time out, well, their coaches would be happy as they could be. Total team effort, a dominating victory. And that does it for another broadcast of the NFL on EA Sports. With my partner in the booth, Brock Heward, I'm Kate Scott. It's a well-earned win for the Giants as we say adios from Mexico City.